This message is for justice. Harun is a man. I sat down 13 hours in the court of appeal listening to the judgment that you and your colleagues passed. I sat down. It was your moment to gloat, to glow, to, to be joyous and say all you had to say. You were the main actors. And the rest of us were there as spectators listening quietly to you. Right? And with my two ears and my eyes looking at you, I heard you when you, you know, with all joy, Say to the to the council to one of the petitioners when they ask you for the judgment whether you have the this where you said oh you make it available to them and when they said there was something you are uh, you said also by the time you were giving that judgment that it is sacrosanct the time for appeal that you are not going to of course that's what the law says so we know it's sacrosanct that there's not going to be any any case where they are going to add any days to someone. So why is it that up till now, the judgment has not been given to the, the councils, to, to the petitioners to do what they, they need for? Whatever they want to do, if they want to just look at it and be staring at it, is it not time for them to have it? The same you that was gleefully telling them that it's sacrosanct, is it not sacrosanct for there to be competence from, from, the, from, the, from the tribunal? Isn't the tribunal itself supposed to be sacrosanct in the way it does its things? If you knew the judgment was not ready, you are not finished putting everything down. It was not time. It was not ready in a way that immediately after your judgment, you are either giving it to them or you are uploading it to your website. Why then did you give a judgment? I listened to you severally when you used, when you were using the word that, oh, it seems the witness invented. So me now that I am a witness, that I saw you and I was looking at you, I am thinking, it seems you invented the fact that let there be this tactical delay that we eat away into the days that, that, that are supposed to be used to file whatever appeal or whatever it is to the Supreme Court or whatever anybody wants to do. I sat down there, I, for, uh, uh, 13 hours listening, listening, listening. At one time I was wondering, ah, what kind of words are these? I thought, ah, oh, is it, is this going to be part of the judgment? Is it what the judgment is, what is being said? Because it was almost as if, was I in the market, just hearing plain? I think it was Lord Denning that said, the words, you know, words are these. There's a, there's a quote by Lord Denning where he talked about how judges are supposed to use words, you know? Sort of like that we flow. They were, the kind of words you were using, you were wondering whether you were in court or you were at the motor park or you were in the market or you were in the village square where people were just throwing words anyhow. It doesn't matter. It's your right to do what you want to do, where you want to do it. But when it comes to issue of competence, when it comes to issue of sacrosanct, the way you use, when you talk about the, it, is, it, has, it is sacrosanct that the number of days will not be increased for anybody. Why then are you eating into the number of days? Why then are you eating? For me, Aisha Yusuf, I am an active Nigerian citizen. I speak for myself and I use this my mouth to speak on my own behalf as a witness that stands that down for over 12 hours, 13 hours, sitting down and listening to judges reading. I'm like, eh, what are they reading here? Then I sat down, no, I listen. I'm a witness. So when you talked about being sacrosanct, so how come now? You don't still have this thing out. How are you going to read something different and then they are not going to, you see, they are done retyping it or what, and some words going to change. There was a part where we heard, oh, eh, explain to me if I didn't hear well, oh, where you were saying that eh, the case, eh, the eh, Labour Party case is now withdrawn. I'm like, ah, is it judges that withdraw cases? I be, what is it? Is it not the person that are putting the case I suppose so? Or is it not judges that are not acting on behalf? If I didn't hear that part, well, part well, tell me, oh, let, let, let me know. Because I sat down there on this one, eh, I'm a witness. So I was there. Nobody told me. I didn't read, I didn't read newspaper. I, in short, I wasn't even hidden because where everybody were wearing black and that color, my, my yellow, yellow gold hijab was there shining. It's really so annoying. That the place where you expect that justice, justice is supposed to be for, for the weak, to protect the weak against the strong. But unfortunately in Nigeria, that doesn't seem to what we have. 
Because I watch you. What I saw that day was you, Justice Samania, and your other colleagues being so happy when you were talking about the respondents and you were you, you were you were talking about how they had done this, how under cross examination, how this, and then the anger, the agitation, the, the disdain when you were talking about the petitioners coming before you. It's all right to it's your court. It's all right to do what you do. I don't know what you people do. I'm not a lawyer. I'm a microbiologist. I'm a microbiologist. I don't know how you people do this thing. But more as a citizen, watching and as, as, a, as a, an eyewitness to what I saw was all of that happening. But you have a right to do that. What you do not have a right to is incompetence. Incompetence of not ensuring that immediately after your judgment that it's available for people to begin to file their appeal or whatever they want to do it. Even if they are not going to file their appeal, let them sit down and be looking at it. Justice Amani, Justice Harunet Amani, your name is Amani as expected. Expected, do the expected. Be competent. Let them let bring everything out and let give it to, to people. Don't eat away out of the hours. 24 hours cannot be recovered again. 70, 48 hours cannot be recovered again. 72 hours cannot be re recovered again. Any hour, any minute that you do not give the, the, the counsels to the petitioners what they need, the judgment and everything, however you people call it, whether it's a defined through copy or whatever you call it, that you don't have let them have it or begin to prepare what they need to use to happy it's injustice of the highest order it's not even only injustice it is sabotage that is how me i shall you for i am seeing it from where i looked at it i was an eyewitness so i sit down for court but did they pain me i sit down i didn't lean back i didn't blink one moment i sat down and I was, I was paying attention to what is going on. And I know I will repeat it again. I heard you talking about how it is Sarko Sant. Let me also talk. Oh, let me talk what is Sarko. There are some quotes here that I need. I really need us to. From Lord Denny. Lord Denny does not have two heads. He has one head. Like every other person. 100 years from now, people are going to be looking at these judgments and reading it. They are not only going to look at the justice, Harun and Samani and wherever it was that was on that thing that did. They are going to look at all of us and say, ah, ah, the people of that era, how were they? What, what, what kind of weddings are they? What kind of this thing is that? So, it is a representation on also my generation. By the time I'm dead, 100 years from now, I won't be there for me to go and be telling them that, ah, we too, that was how we saw it too. The issue of Nigerian judiciary where, uh, uh, what do you call it now? Uh, uh, I see appointment or whatever. It's based on seniority. That thing, eh, they need, the judicial system needs to be rejected. You know, they need to be rejected. Turn upside down and fix. Competence must trump how old you are. Because the person old, no come me say the person gets sense past another person where they there where suppose where gets sense where he go do what he go do. Age, you no know, they give person sense. No being they give person sense. At this moment, we need to ensure the right thing is being done. Lord Danny said the purpose of the law is to protect the weak against the strong. Not the one that we will see that is the strong that are coming out to display their strength, and then it's the weak that is being used to uh uh. It won't happen, no. We are all citizens in this country. It's all our, it's all our country. Every one of us. We have, we own Nigeria equally. No Nigerian is more Nigerian than any Nigerian. Lord Denning also said, oh, the law is not a technical game to be played by experts, but rather a living force to be applied with wisdom and compassion. We are not even asking for wisdom and compassion. Now, me, I'm not asking for wisdom and compassion. All I'm asking for is competence. Ensure that these lawyers get the judgment that you have read. The judgment that you finally televised. When you didn't televise the whole way where they were bringing evidence. But give them and let them do their work. So that that sacrosanct you said, your word should also be sacrosanct. You giving them the judgment immediately after should be sacrosanct. Ensuring that you had everything prepared before you just came out and sat down and read those judgments. They too should be sacrosanct. Let me remind all of us again. No Nigeria is more Nigeria than any Nigerian.